Hi, my name is Kevin Good and welcome back to my channel. On this particular playlist, we are learning beginning Hebrew. We left off last time with the numbers. We're going to continue with the numbers. I had given you guys a chart, but I briefly explained it, but I wanted to take the time to dive into the chart a little bit more so that way you guys can understand what's going on with the chart and then we'll move forward from there. Uh, remember, if you like the content on this channel, please hit the like button and uh, subscribe and also the notification bell so that way you know when I release new content. All right, let's dive on in. Okay. Okay, so here we have it. Okay, this was the full chart, but we're gonna break it down a little bit. All right, over here are the numbers that we learned already, one through nine, and we have their uh, letter represented, representation. So Aleph, Bet, Gimel, Dalet, He, Vav, Zayin, Chet, and Tet. Aleph is one, Bet is two, Gimel, three, Dalet, four, He, five, Vav, six, Zayin, seven, chet, eight, and tet, uh, tet is nine. And then, you know, achat, shtaim, shalosh, arba, chamesh, shesh, sheva, um, shmone, and tesha. So tesha. And then over here, we have the multiples of ten. You know, like in English, it's ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, so forth. That's what this is in Hebrew. So right here, yud is ten, kaf is twenty, Lamed is 30, Mem is 40, Nun is 50, Samech 60, Ain is 70, and if we keep going forward, um, Pe is 80, and then Sadiq 90, Kuf 100, Resh 200, Shin is 300, and Tab is 400. So if we go back up, there we already know 10, Eser and Asara. So next we have 20, which is Esrim. And that's Kaf. 30, Shloshim, and that's Lamed. 40, Arbaim, and that's Mem. 50, Chamishim, and that's Nun. 60, Shishim, and that's Samech. 70, Shivim, and that's Ain. And then 80, Shmonim, and that's Pe. And 90 is Tishim, and that's Sadiq. And then 100 is Mea, and that's Kuf. And then 200 is Meotaim, and that's Resh. 300 is Shlosh Meot, and that's Shin. 400 Arba Meot, and that's Tav. Okay? All right, so let's break that down a little bit more. How do we use those? Okay, if we have 21, that's going to be Kaf and Aleph. If you see it, like in the Torah or the Bible, it's like a Hebrew English Bible in the Old Testament. Yeah, in the Old Testament. Um, it would be, you'll see Kaf and Aleph, and that's going to be 21. And that's Esrim Be'achad. Okay, that's 21. Or you might see Kaf and Dalet, and that would be Esrim Be'arba. Esrim is 20. Ve can almost be looked at as plus, but but and four, 20 and four. So, Asrim ve Abba. And then if we came over, uh, Arbaim ve Arba, 44, uh, and so forth. And, and that's gonna be Mim and Dalit, or Mim ve Aleph, 41, etc. Okay, if we keep going forward, same thing here. We have Shmonim for 80. So, um, so if we have Pe and then Aleph, Shmonim ve Achat, Pe uh, Be'arba, Shmonim Be'arba, Pe Be'for, it's sometimes confusing switching back and forth between English, but you guys get what I'm saying. So um, so basically if I see here Pe and Dalet, Shmonim Be'arba, Dalet is four. Eventually you'll start to memorize it if that's the path that you want to go down, otherwise if it's not, no one through ten. Uh, 10 through 20, you know, 1 through 20, and you should be okay. But just know when you see the letters like this before something, they represent numbers. And I have an example for that in this um, presentation. Right here we have Jeremiah, and we have Perik 11, um, which is uh, basically, what is that? If we go back up, 11, um, Asar Ve'achat, and that's Yud and Aleph. Right here, Yud and Aleph. And over here we have Jeremiah 21. Kaf ve Aleph. And let's
let's go see what Koth is. Koth is 20, and Aleph, 21. Okay, so that's the number right here, and here we have Te'alim, and Te'alim is basically chapter 74. So that's Shivim Be Arba, um, Ayn, and Dalet. 70, let's find 70. 70 is right here. We know that Shivim, Ayn, Ve Dalet. Dalet is 4. Ayn, Ve Dalet, Shivim, Ve Arba. And that's 74. Okay, that's it for today. I hope you guys are enjoying the content on this particular playlist and on this channel. If you are, please hit the like button. Please hit subscribe and the notification bell so that way you know when I release new content. I look forward to seeing you next time. Have a great day.